do you want me to be brutally honest? Have you ever heard the saying, anything that's too much is, is bad for you, innit? You, know, you eat 20 bananas, mate, it's bad for you. Bananas yeah. are good for you. You eat 20 bananas, they're bad for you. Yeah. You know, you brush your teeth 20 times a day, it's bad for you. So, fighting 24 hours. Do you have hours. to brush your teeth 20 times? I don't brush my teeth. <laughs> <laughs> I wake up and they're white. I bet they are. Stop it, John, with the little jokes. <laughs> It's that cliche thing. I don't think nowhere's like Team Carbon and they probably say the same about their gym and every other gym says the same about their gym and that's just how it's meant to be. It's like when you were a kid and you used to say, your mum's food's the best. Cliche. Everyone thinks their mum, mum's food's the best. I mean, my mum's food is the best. Anyone want to fight about it? Till in the black, Masvidal in the red, Southport versus Orth Oh! Early from Till. He floors Masvidal. And then I've got like... Oh, you've got a couple of bits. I've got a tap and fart. So when I'm in an elevator, I use that just to, just to make the situation awkward. I just don't give a f For this fight, I was coming back from a, like a really dark place, you know. Before my fight with Woodley, I felt like I was invincible. And then to come off two devastating losses, and you know, I've moved up, and in my opinion, fought the bulldozer of the middleweight division. And yeah, it was, you know, I was a close fight joker the went either way. But listen, I proved a lot of f***ing out is wrong. And I want you to message me tonight and say something about it. F*** you. Yeah. To tell you, I was trying to fake an injury before walking out. I was thinking of an injury to fake because I just simply did not want to get in there. And this is probably things that fighters don't talk about, but you know me, I'm honest. You know, and, 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 and that's just where I was at. Um, now I'm here, confidence is back. Like, f*** all these middleweights. You know, I'm coming for everything. It's back. I don't have anything to say but one thing. Sweet Caroline. Da, da, da. Oh, there it is again, the left hand. Milichkovic. Beautiful. That's noodle legs. Sharp shooter. He's looking to pour in the pressure now. Darren Till calls Wants him back him to back his up. feet. The crowd are loving this one. This is where it all started, mate, because I'll never forget. For my birthday, my birthday's on Christmas Eve, I went and bought the Rocky box set. Now, the Rocky box set nowadays must be cost about father. Yeah. But back then, it cost 50 quid in right. HMV. And I bought it, and I swear to God, I must have washed that a million times, each one. It, it was Rocky one to five, six of them came out, yeah. And it's when you were 10? I must have been about 10, 11. Right. And I used to watch it in my back bedroom and my dad bought me some Everlast hand wraps. Yeah. And I'd put them on, never told anyone this by the way, and I'd just shadow box in front of the, the, the telly, but you know when the music was coming on? Yeah, oh, yeah. So I'd be watching it and the music would be like, right, that's it. Do a little bit of boxing. If you want my honest opinion on if Marvin Vittori can take my power shots, I am pretty confident he can, because his head is absolutely huge. So I'm going to have to come in and throw in a hundred punches at once to try and knock him out. He's got a big old Italian stallion Rocky Balboa head. Uh, it's huge. I'm in awe of it. What's, what's going on with the wheel? Like I seen a guy the other day, he ordered a coffee and, and was going. He took three pictures to get the right image and I'm like, come on, man, what the f*** are you doing? In 200 years, they're going to remember my name in, in combat sports. It's a moment he has willed into existence in his hometown. And Till has a back oh, on the fence, a big left the hand. Down. There it is, Till is Till. on top. Who the f is that with me now? No one. Every, every fight, no matter what any fighter will ever tell you, they, they will be scared. If, if they tell you they're not, it's, 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 it's a blatant lie. But this fight, I wasn't scared. I was terrified. I, I wasn't shaken. But I, I just didn't want to go. I didn't. The, the magnitude of the event, <clears throat> everything. I, it just. I was. I was doubting. I was thinking of ways to get out of the fight. It, it, this was only today, and I'm just so scared. And then the first round over, I'm like, Darren, come on, pull yourself together. And I was like, okay, now we're gonna win this fight the way we planned. We're, gonna, we're not gonna let him touch you, and you're gonna win it on, a, on you know, whatever. I knew it could be hard to knock him out. I know I've got the power, but I know he's a t he's a tough cookie and. You know, that's just how it is. The fighters might not say it, but I'll always say it. Whether it, you know, it's good or bad. I've been criticised in the past or whatever, but that's where that's where I was at today. As soon as I woke up, even though I proper proper believe that one day I'd be a millionaire and and I'd have all nice stuff, I proper proper didn't believe that I'd have it. 
which is a mad mentality in it at the same mm. and it's it was like a double mentality like you're gonna get that and there's like another part of you think, you're never gonna get that done what, why do you think there is that? i don't know i've always been that way ask uh, ask people who know me proper closely they know i'm a very uh there's a word for it uh pessimist or something or pessimist yeah yeah uh, like i'm very be- i'm very invested in myself and believe and at the same time i'm not like, I don't believe as well, which is crazy because you know me, mate. I'll, I'll... But with fighting, you've always been steadfast by saying you're going to be the champion. Yeah. And you're, uh, you you're have a quest great, for great greatness. greatness. Yeah. But... And, and I don't believe it at the same time. Okay. It's mental. I don't think I've ever said this, have I? I don't think I've ever brought this sure. up. I don't think I have, but it's just that we're on the subject and it's just easy talking. I've always fully believed, like, and now I tell you, I know I'm one of the best fighters in the world. I'm going to be one of the best. But a disbeliever as well. It's mad that, isn't it? It's mad that I can just come out and say it. A lot of fighters wouldn't be able to come out and say it, but I'm not saying that. It's a weakness, it's insecurities, but I don't, I'm not bothered by insecurities or weakness, that's why I'll say it. He's, he's, got to, he's got to get into it first. You know, he's cho- Oh, look at that! Beautiful work! Cowboy again, taking one of those left hands on the chin. Oh, there's a massive elbow there from Till. He's oh. up. It's a rally of punches here from Darren Till. Cowboy's turned away from his opponent. Mark got a second no- look. Beautiful finish there for the Gorilla. He awarded the opportunity and he met it. All them doubters, yes! Say him what now? Now! Who the f-